Hey everyone, it's Richie923 and I'm on Geek Status. We're gonna kick back today, it's Friday, August 5th. Hope you guys are having an awesome week again. I've uploaded a couple new review videos. Those uh, are the type of videos that uh, I want to be the meat and potatoes of this channel. Revisit some of these toys. Um, a lot of these, I've just been displaying them and for the first time in like, you know, a few years, I'm actually turning them on and playing with them and kind of reliving it uh, with you guys. So that's kind of the uh, kind of the idea. So I hope you guys are enjoying those videos so far. Um, anything else you wanna see, anything else I can improve on, uh, I'm welcoming feedback. I know I should offer some sort of engagement within those videos, uh, but I'm just not the like and subscribe kind of guy. I, just, I, I feel a little bit dirty when I say something like that. I'll, I'm open to comments, open to suggestions. Um, I just want to have fun and hope you guys are having fun too. I am slowly stepping out of the Power Rangers collecting game. The only thing I'm getting right now are just the Lightning Collection Mighty Morphin stuff uh, just to complete this. But um, I have to have an end game somewhere with, with my collection. I'll buy things every now and then, but for the Lightning Collection, uh, I, I'm almost there. I'm just waiting on if they have a Squat and Babu, if there's a Bulk and Skull, maybe. Uh, I would definitely love a Lightning Collection Radbug or some sort of representation of the Radbug. And definitely the Power Weapons. A couple weeks ago, I got the Power Lance. Yesterday, I got the Power Sword. I'm gonna do a full in-depth review on these. Uh, just, just really quick. I'm sorry, that's just too cool. Sorry, not gonna get too into it. We'll do that in a future video. Speaking of upcoming videos, I'm working on a workflow. I wanna put one of these out a week. Some topics that I wanna cover are the toy exhibit itself. I wanna do the Morphin Grid by itself, maybe as an anniversary special for the 29th anniversary of Mighty Morphin. Again, I initially said I wasn't going to Power Morphicon this year due to various reasons, um, but I did check some flight tickets and it's looking a little bit tempting to go. I bought tickets back in 2019 with a good buddy of mine. Pandemic happened, the world shut down, the world got sick. So the world is still a little weird right now, so I'm not really keen on going, but if the talk is happening, like this might be the last Morphicon. It is like on the eve of the 30th anniversary. They announced that Hasbro's presence is gonna be, you know, they only have a presentation there. I was hoping for something a little bit more official in depth. It's tempting to go more now because I'm getting into the social game. I am talking to a few of you online. It would be awesome to just get involved with the, the fan community again. Maybe we can make that happen at Paramorphicon or I'm definitely going to New York Comic Con, so if some of you are going there, um, awesome. We can uh, just link up, say what's up, geek out for a hot second, and that's it. I'm going to keep working on stuff. Uh, this is an awesome way to kind of spend my free time. It's helping me clear my head a little bit. Uh, the world's going kind of crazy, the world kind of sucks, and uh, I am very fortunate to have all of this behind me, all of this in front of me, my production gear. I have the opportunity. And I'm just going to do it. This is Richie923. I'll see you next time.